Commissioner, colleagues, EU Budget 2021 will be the first one for the new MFF. It will also become the first sign and symbol for new European ambitions for the next seven years. I will start with key programmes. Enhancing Horizon Europe is highly important to boost the digital transformation. This is pretty straightforward. COVID crisis showed us all how much we depend on technologies. Technologies which are both not perfect and not equally available to every EU country and to every European. Investment in research and innovation must both bring new advanced solutions and narrow the gap between member states, regions and social groups. Fighting digital inequality will be in future as crucial as fighting social or any other inequalities we are dealing with right now. As a part of the overall MFF deal, the flagship programme Horizon Europe will receive additional 4 billion euros for research and innovation. It's a great news for European scientists. And that means we have to stand for corresponding increase in annual allocation for 2021 already. The COVID crisis has proved once again that medical workers and healthcare systems are probably as important as military personnel and armies. Our enemy right now is invisible and we need medicine and vaccines rather than guns and bombs to defeat it. EU for Health is the answer to major cross-border health threats and one of the so needed steps to create a European health union. Additional 3.4 billion as a part of the MFF triples the budget of the programme. We all do understand that in order to meet current challenges and to prepare for the future ones, we need to increase financing for 2021 significantly. This budget is crucial in order to increase the quality of healthcare systems around Europe and their affordability, and of course in order to deal with inequalities between member states and regions. One more programme out of enhanced 15 flagship programmes to mention Erasmus+. Plus. It's our strategic investment, investment in our use, in social cohesion, in European integration. It is investment in our values, identity and heritage that we wish to pass over to the next generations. 2.2 billion of additional money within the next seven years and at least 165 million next year. At the same time, I would like to outline, Europe can afford much more for its values. Budget 2021 is a good deal helping us in both enhancing and rethinking the way European institutions work during the COVID crisis and after it, when the new normal will arrive. Starting from the European Parliament itself, all the institutions are fighting with the challenges of teleworking in 24 different languages, with different quality of internet and technical advancement around continent. Nevertheless, they all work hard bringing Europeans and their ideas together, like for instance the Committee of Regions, our Social and Economic Committee. Our experience from previous economic crises tells cut down the estimates for institutions. It's not the case this time. The estimates for institutions and agencies take into account both the tasks to be performed next year and the level of possible transformations that each institution may go through, finding the best suitable way to work in the future. I wish us all good luck in next forthcoming negotiations with the Council. Thank you.